Hey folks, Matt from RightlyImage.com. I have a viewer writing in MTBDDS. That's the YouTube username. Hi, I really enjoyed your video. This was about the FZ1000. Unfortunately, I was a little lost with the technical jar jargon. What I want to know is, do you think this camera would be sufficient for taking pics of my son playing basketball in a gym? I wouldn't be too far away like the third row of a high school gym. Basically, the lenses, the reach of the lenses, no problem there, but the lens isn't fast enough and it does have a smaller sensor. So when you're in gym with lower lighting, that's where your problem is going to come is you're not going to be able to get the shutter speeds you probably need to freeze your son playing. Unless you're talking about using off-camera flash, which you can, but most people don't go to a gym and set that up when they're watching their kid playing. So, um, you know, my reply is that I think it would struggle in indoor lighting of most gyms. Uh, I guess it depends how your how well your your gym is lit. Uh, I don't think most are lit adequately enough that the FZ 1000s not going to struggle for focus and shutter speed that you're going to need to get good shots. Um, you'd be better off with a camera with better high ISO abilities like the Panasonic G7 and a longer lens um, that you can you know work with there, or even a longer prime. Um, or the Canon T6i or the Nikon D5500. Any of those would be better because of the larger sensors, better high ISO abilities, so that, that means you can shoot in dimmer lighting, which you're going to have in the gym. It may not seem dimmer. When you start using a camera, um, you're going to realize it is because the camera is going to need higher shutter speeds and um, it's not. It, it's going to need that higher ISO and that's going to be better on these cameras that I'm recommending, the G7 from Panasonic, the T6i from Canon, and the Nikon D5500 than the FZ1000. FZ1000 is a great camera. I'm not knocking it. I just don't think it's probably going to be satisfactory for you. I think you're going to be disappointed using it to try and take sports photos indoors of your son in the gym. So what do you guys think? Do you agree with me? Leave your comments below. Let's discuss it. Um, thank you very much for your question and stay tuned. We'll be back soon here at artoftheimage.com.